Hey brawlers and welcome to my review of episode 49 of Armored Alliance, I'm Haru Ren. So spoiler warning, if you haven't seen this episode yet, go back and watch it now. But if you have, sit back, relax, and enjoy my review of Armored Alliance episode 49. We're really close to the end. This episode is called the Awesome Brawlers Bakugan Battle League. Since Havoc can't be found and he's preparing for the final battle, we got time to waste, so why not quench our battling thirst with a self-made tournament, even though the end of the world's near. The Awesome Brawlers Bakugan Battle League. It's way too long of a name. And yes, it really seems like this is a two-parter filler. There's not really too much significance with all this going on, but I gotta say the battles are pretty cool to watch. This whole entire episode is literally battles, 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 and pairings between characters we haven't seen in this season. Heck, they even do throwbacks with the jokes they do before or during the battles, like a Jeet forgetting China Riot's name, Chad bringing up current Spike Mask persona, Shun being some punk while being disguised. We see characters that we've encountered all season gather together all one last time in one episode throwback. No offense, but I think your mask is super dorky. This, 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 this dorky? Damn, Mac is savage. I mean, during the fight between Dan and Curran, Dan even acknowledges that Curran and other background characters that they have met and have been featured all season, that they all became stronger. Surely they will be contributing to the final episodes of the season. It's down to Winton, Ajit, Leah, and Dan in the finals of the AB Battle League. Oh, Trox defeated so easily! How could this happen? It appears that we've won! Peril! Behind you! Huh? <laughs> Trox hasn't retracted, how can you think you've won? But Ajit and Winton is a battle that's actually pretty good, even busting out moves we haven't seen before. Ajit wins after using double teams, so it's Dan vs. Leon next, and this battle was also really fun to watch, having a battle of Baku gear. I admire that Dan doesn't use the infinity armor since that would probably make it a one-sided fight. Though, the story with this one is trying to prove which bond is stronger, so they each battle with their eyes closed, while the moves are slopping as intended, it's pretty funny, but eventually they get the hang of it, and it actually works. And then both gets Baku gear, so it's Vestroya vs Crystal Blaster creating a classic stalemate between the two blasts, but Drago of course moves quickly and beats Pegatrix. So we actually get a rematch between Ajit and Dan from the first Battle League. Oh my god, it's gonna be an exciting fight, wonder who is going to win this time- Oh, everyone looks pumped up! Aw oh, crud, it's Havoc. So this whole tournament was a relative waste of time, but I guess this episode is reaching time, so whatever. Havoc invites the Awesome Brawlers to participate in his Bakugan Battle League as the episode ends in a cool shot. So that was Armor Alliance episode 49. Let me know what your rating of the show was in the comments down below. This episode was a filler episode, but this was an episode that is close to the end and it seemed like it was one last opportunity to showcase and reflect upon the season in the form of a fun little tournament. You can easily tell where there are some good ribs and references here and there in this episode. Some of the action was goofy, some of it was funny, and some were pretty good. I'm guessing that this is supposed to be a small pit stop to build up the final battle that will take two episodes to get through. Even Dan acknowledging everyone being stronger so clearly they must have some involvement, right? Now with Havoc ready to implement his little game, it's time to get ready for what comes next. So, for this episode, having good battles and being entertaining as well as small reflection, I'll give this a low Baku good. I apologize for the length of this episode, it's not really too much to talk about, but you know, it was fun to watch. But, I'm just ready for the final episodes already. NEXT! Thank you for watching this review of Armored Alliance. Be sure to press the like button and give us a subscribe for more awesome Bakugan content. I've been Haru Ren, and thank God for Rapid Fire. Bye!